Let's go back then to this, uh, your latest posting this morning. What about Portugal makes you smile? What surprised you here um, this morning as you were up doing this, Bruce? Nothing. It, it was warm, very, very heartwarming, the things that people had to say. Um, Thank goodness for that. Eh? So a few moments away from controversy for you on Facebook, which is <laughs> to be a blessing. <laughs> hearing, hearing the whistle of the neighborhood knife sharpener on his bike rounds. That is beautiful. We're going to have more of these now. Um, what makes you smile about Portugal? Most everything. People, food, scenery, a culture of kindness. If you don't have to deal with the bureau, bureaucracia, it's phenomenal, says Jimmy. Uh, this makes me happy to be here on holiday. Look, there's something like a sangria and a pastel donata combo going on there. Michelle says the architecture, the people, the food, the art of enjoying life. That's a nice way of putting it, isn't it? The safety, the relaxation I feel, the beauty, the compassion. This is lovely, Bruce. Uh, thank you for asking this question. And thanks to all these lovely people for answering it. The sense of community, the collective heart and warmth of the people. Uh, that's George. Stephanie waking up in the morning and realizing it's not just a dream. Oh, living here, says Dan. Ian, all the identity politics and woke culture rubbish hasn't found its way over here yet. I hope, says Ian. Uh, Lynn, opening the blinds to a new day and thinking this is all ours. Heart, heart. How lovely. The food, says Ryan. The people, says Ian. Manuela says everything, pretty much everything. Uh, Matthew agreeing with Manuela there. David Rocha, everything. The air smells so crisp and nice. The water tastes so good. The people, food, culture, the language so polite. The architecture, everything is just beautiful. Truly God's land, says David. Smile or laugh, says Esther. And when I think back to visiting Porto and my friend's father was giving us a tour of the city, he jaywalks and my friend would yell, bye, bye, at him angrily when he would trot across roads and leave us at the crosswalks. It really cracked us up. So we all started yelling pie at him for the rest of the two days. Thank you, Mrs. M. Uh, this is wonderful. So well done there, Bruce, for asking that question. But, but see, this is something that we could not get from the magazine in its other format. Okay, they must have been already within... The hour that I've posted that, yeah. there must have been already 20 interactions, yeah. 20 people participating, okay, interactively. Yes. Um, that didn't really, that couldn't happen with the magazine because it's not an interactive format. So there are people that don't like Facebook, okay, and there are people, and we're looking, for those who don't li like Facebook, we're looking at alternative um See, no face back. Yeah, that's one. Yeah, yeah, there's one right there. Yeah, there are uh, there are people that just don't like it. So, I mean, we are looking into. Toto told me. Um, <laughs> he just he just told me he said that um, that going in new direct taking our website into a new direction um, might be a possibility. You know. That, okay. Yeah. But, you know, you can't argue with Facebook in terms of. Reach, the, right? yeah. You know, in terms of the numbers, there are so many others that have tried to compete with it. But Carl, you know, uh, you know the metrics because you're in the media. You know how important it is to know how many people are watching, how many people are engaged, how many people, you know, follow you regularly and so forth. There is um, no other medium you know, Google does it, uh, to, but I don't get it from Instagram. I don't get it from YouTube. I don't get it from um, uh, LinkedIn. Facebook gives you a precise photograph, a capture yes. of who your audience is. Okay, mm -hmm. And, um, you know, when you add things to it, like we just, we did a survey um, and... Uh, I, I want you to know, um, are we putting up too much? Are we not putting up enough? Are we putting up too little uh, each day? I want to know what don't you want to see? Because I go every day through the posts and lots of them have many likes and comments and so forth. And some of them have none. It seems like people do not want to read Portuguese food recipes. Okay, oh, they, really? Okay. That was one of the things that, 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 that they don't want. Um, okay. And anything long-winded they don't want. We asked, you know, uh, what their status was in terms of Portugal. 
and we found that um, it pretty well broke down. The majority are here living in Portugal. The majority of our our our, our readers or uh, or followers are here living in Portugal. I'd say some of them are looking for a second home or a vacation home in Portugal. Many of them are new residents who just arrived, and a, probably about a quarter of them are um, in the process, thinking about moving to Portugal, investigating, researching, and so forth. And we help them in their research, I guess. But Amazing. So, okay. you know, yeah, that's interesting. I think it's yes. interesting. And it helps me just, I'm sure as it helps you from your perspective, um, to make sure that the content is appealing to your audience. Yeah. Yeah, right. And and this is what T Duck is saying. You, you do have to make sure the content is appealing, but also um, appropriate, don't you? And, and and you have to manage other people's comments. Be careful. Have an alternative. Post one yeah. thing and they don't like, right. and you will be deplatformed. Everything on Facebook must follow their narrative, or you're gone. No thanks. I was gone. Yeah, I you've, you've gone. been through that, haven't you? Yes, you've. Oh, you've yeah, I, 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 I I cease to exist. Yes, I cease to exist. They they closed me down. Not just. Not just um, you know the uh, the Portugal Living magazine, but they took me personally off of Facebook. And there's nobody you can complain to. There's nobody you can talk to. There's no way you can. Um, uh, the, there's no way that you can ask for a you know uh, a reason. You you just it's one way communication. You to them. It's not going to be so ultimately. There's a trick. Okay, I just changed the SIM in, in one of the SIMs in my uh, mobile phone and what? logged in under a different phone number. And so I've had to recreate my profile. I've had to I've gotten a lot of different new friends in, in, in the process, but I'm still trying to get back, you know, um, my former friends. I mean, they're still friends, Incredible. but we, you have to start from scratch. And and he's right. It is a royal pain in the ass. I am not. I hate. I have written numerous columns talking about Facebook phobia and yeah. how much um, I dislike about Facebook. But sometimes you have to look and say, well, what are my options? Okay. Yes. What, what other ways can it's I go? Clear we're at the moment, isn't it? There is. There is certainly some some clear challenges with this. Um, and I'm, I'm. I think you're very well aware of of T Ducks. Um, uh, feedback to you on this, you know, it is, it is balancing the the incredible um, piece of technology that it is, right? Yeah. Um, with with how powerful and um, how um, I suppose the word, I mean, in terms of people's privacy, um, how invasive Facebook is, is yes. as well. So yeah, and you have people who love Facebook. I mean, I do. I I, I think it's been an amazing tool, notwithstanding what T Duck. I mean, what T Duck says is true. And and also it um, has bring a, uh, brought a besides, lot of joy. This, the, you know, besides their no nos, I mean, I think it's it 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 offends me. I find it offensive when right. Facebook tells me I should friend this person. Okay, they give me <laughs> suggestions about what to do with my life, or yes. you might want to join this group, or um, uh, then they'll reprimand me. Sue. Sue, uh, 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 Juana jo uh, Joao Mendes is still waiting for a reply from you. You know, yeah. it, it's it, it's like they're paying, paying my parent, but they're not my parent, and I won't let them be my parent. <laughs> if you hear if you hear Bruce shout out, "You're not my dad," he's talking to Facebook in his office. Wow, um, that's that's incredible. So, notwithstanding the limitations, I think we can all agree on. Um, you are that is where how it's going to be, and there is the link to the ongoing publishing of the wonderful uh, sources of, of news and information and pictures that Bruce finds um, consistently for for us all. Uh, Facebook.com forward slash Portugal Living Magazine, and there's a Q and A that goes with it, Portugal Living Q and A, where it does tend to kick off as well, and that's what um, I would like to. Uh, ask you about if you do want to transfer that anytime to the um, phone in format and people you know one of the lim one of the other limitations of facebook is when you do start having a conversation with somebody and it's getting a little bit heated there's something quite limiting isn't there about that little box on and and words and um i would i'd be delighted to host co-host with your phone in bruce where people can actually 
take it beyond, lift it off the page, if you like, lift it off the page and talk about it with the aim of trying to get some understanding. Because so many times the Facebook conclusion is division, isn't it? It, it tends yeah. to divide rather than unite people. So if we yeah. can work together in some way, I'd be delighted to do a regular um, Iberian FM phone in with you that is Portugal living flavoured. So please have that as an option. Yeah, let's let's consider that. I mean, it would be amazing having you on the end of the phone in as well, and people oh. people calling in. Um, so T Duck will miss the magazine, but keep an eye on it. And where so people, he's got to look at Facebook though to find out what the new developments might be. <laughs> that, there you go. Um, do any of your readers who are familiar? Uh, do any of your viewers, your audience, who are familiar with the magazine, have they ordered it in the print copy? Because it's yes. all of our issues, or most of our issues, our first couple of ones weren't enough pages. Um, to be printed, they're all available on Amazon. Oh, so those those who we have a lot of people, you know, you, you can't please all of the people all of the time. I mean, there were people who said that no way. Um, when 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 they got the magazine in PDF format like that, and, and I don't know if you can flip if you have it where you can flip through the pages. We're, gonna be, are, we're flipping through. We're flipping okay, through, yeah. well there you go. Um, they said it's just too much you know and a lot of people the majority of people are reading this on their mobile okay yeah. um right now you're you know you're moving through the beginning of the book where, where there are a lot of ads and there are a lot of short things um and, and 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 so forth but later on i mean there are 102 pages there it it yeah. uh it it can get tedious and so people there are people who would prefer to read it in a print format and we were able to work with amazon to get it up in a print format and it's print on demand so it's in my it, it, it it's it's environmentally friendly in that they only print there's no wastage they only print copies that have been ordered yeah right and we, well, the, it, it, these these the old the, the uh, back issues are basically classics now. They are still full yes. of relevant and useful information. So you can, if you want a copy, or you want to send somebody a copy in the United States, as a nice present um, with with all this incredible information. You could check out the in, the index contents, couldn't you? And think, well, yes. that's a good one to print out, and you can print it out for yourself or print it out for somebody else. And a lot of this, a lot of the um, issues that are covered in here within the issues. Uh, it's timeless information. Selling selling Portugal is one of Bruce's own articles there. I'm scrolling through. I'm only a third of the way through here. I mean, there's just so much in this current edition. 102 this, pages is your um, is your your climactic uh, in print uh, PDF version. Is 102 pages. Incredible achievement, Bruce. So as as we turn our attention to how this might be in the future, I do want to congratulate you and thank you for the um, contribution you've made to the Portuguese expat culture with this. I mean, it's been amazing, isn't it? The, how long have, has it actually been in print and how long have, have you been doing Portugal Living Magazine as we used to know Three it? Years. Three years. Three years. Yeah, there you go. And all, all the great and the good, anyone who's anyone within the um, Portuguese expat scene has been in there at some point, haven't they? Is it yeah, if you keep on scrolling down, you'll come to a one of... Um, one of the departments that we have in every issue is called My Story, where somebody yeah. just shares their own personal story, and they've all been interesting. And then we have um, a, a department called Neighbors. And these yeah. are basically things I've picked up on Facebook that um, you know people have said about something they've experienced, something anecdotally, um, um, and, and so we'll have a dozen of them on two pages, you know, and, and people yeah. can relate to that. You know, yeah. uh, we, we get a lot of feedback about that. That's tremendous. It's well, well done. Well done. As you, as you turn your attention now um, to possibly finding additional formats to Facebook, thank you, Bruce, for, for, for where you've got to with this and the incredible effort you've put in over the last three years. And, but you, and you'll still keep coming along on, on a monthly basis, right? We'll still have the... Where do I send the link to Bruce, and we'll and we'll, we'll get you on the screen eventually oh, on the, the fourth the fourth Tuesday of every month, right? So I look forward to your company in the future, and and I yours, and <laughs> Mrs M's, and Mrs M as well. You've been enjoying that. She, she didn't know if she was speaking to you or not. Another one of the things about Facebook: a lot of people are having their IDs kidnapped at the moment, yes. aren't they? 
Well, I'm going to, uh, by way of a celebration and um, turning a corner here and, and coming to a milestone of the uh, end of the Portugal Living magazine as we knew it uh, and its new format now, we're going to have a bit more bagpiping, uh, which is not a euphemism, it's actual bagpiping here, which was captured by John on his tour around the UK. So we'll go out with that. But is there anything you want to say before you go off today and have your exciting procedure and everything? <laughs> I, I very much enjoy um uh... I always, Carl, you were one of the first people that I met when I moved yes, all yeah. over five years ago. I'm just so glad that we've kept in touch one way or the other, whether it's been email, whether it's been online, whether it's been Facebook or or, or whatever. I, I very much appreciate you and what you're doing. I think we're kindred spirits in certain ways. And I, I, I enjoy your audience. I, I enjoy the give and take between your audience. And uh, I appreciate you having me on. I, I, oh, I, well, I, 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 long may it continue my friend so love to you all all the pets and to well, us and send us some video of him assassinating a few flies with rubber I bands will, i will try to do that that assumes that i can do yes you need a camera you need a camera good enough to capture that don't no, you I need a, <laughs> it's not the camera i need to be able to do use the camera <laughs> yes and, and wear the appropriate safety gear obviously yes. when filming yes. such a dangerous thing yes. okay, okay. You take care. Anything okay. Toward, okay. Happening with that. take well, care you have hope, hope all goes well today ciao ciao okay. bye 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 Thank mm -hmm. you.